Go draw aside the curtains and discover the several caskets to this noble prince. A curtain is drawn showing a gold, silver, and lead casket. Now make your choice. The first of gold, who this inscription bears, who chooseth me shall gain what many men would desire. The second, silver, which, which this promise carries, who chooseth me shall get as, as much as he deserves. The third, dull lead, with warning all his blows, who chooseth me shall, get, shall give all and hazard all he hath. How shall I know if I choose, choose right? The one of them contains my picture, Prince. If you choose that, then I am yours with all. Some god direct my judgment. Let me see. I will survey the inspections back again. What says this lady casket? Who chooseth, who chooseth me shall give, must give, give and hazard all, yeah? Must give for what? For lead? Hazard for lead? This casket threatens. Men in that hazard all do it hope of fairness and fair advantages. A golden mind stoops not to show the dust. Thus I'll give nor hazard aught for lead. What says the silver with the virgin to hue? Who chooses me shall get as much as he deserves. As much as he deserves. Weigh the value of an Athenian hand. If thou best be rated by, estima by this, thy estimation, thou dost not deserve enough. And yet enough may not extend as far as a lady. And yet be, be afraid of, of my deserving, were but a weak dis disabling by myself. As much as I deserve? Why? This, why the, that's the lady. I do in birth deserve her, and in fortunes, in graces, and in qualities of breeding. But more than those, in love. In love I do deserve, but what if I stayed no further, but chooseth here? Let's see once more this saying graved in gold. Who chooseth me, who chooseth me shall gain what many men desire. Why, that's the lady. All the world desires her. From the four corners of the earth, they come to kiss this shrub, the mortal breathing saint. The Iraqian deserts, and the vast, in the vasty wilds of wide Arabia. As the thoroughfares now for the princes to come view fair Portia, the watery kingdom, whose ambitions hate and heed the spirits in the face of in the face of heaven, is no bar to stop foreign spirits, but they come, as o'er book, see fair Portia, one of these containers, and her heavenly picture. To think so base a thought, to be too gross, to rip her sear cloth and observe the grave. Or shall I think that the silver she's immature, being ten times undervalued to try this gold? Oh, sinful thought! Never such a rich gem has it set in a worse than gold. We have in England a coin that bears the figure of an angel stamped in gold, but that's inscribed upon. But here, an angel in a golden bed lies within. Deliver me the key. Here I choose and thrive as I may. There, take it, prince. And if my form lie there, then I am yours. Oh hell! What is it? What have we here? A Cherian, a Cherian death, within a within a hose empty. Aye, there is a there is a written scroll. I will read the writing. All that glitters is not gold. Often have you heard that told, many a man his and many a man his life hath sold, but my outside to behold, glitter tombs do worms enfold. Have you been wife as bold, young in limbs in judgment old, your scene had not been inscrolled. Fare you fare you well, you have suit is cooled. Cold indeed, its harbour lost. Then farewell, hear it, welcome frost. Portia, adieu, I have too grieved a heart to take tedious lyrics, thus losers part. A gentle riddance, draw the curtains and go, let all of his complexions choose me so.
Thank you.